asking why these fans need to save the team. Hopeful Bay Area homeowners take drastic measures to try and realize their dream. Rediscovering the past, how a Bay Area Native American fulfills an obligation to his ancestors. We're back in just two minutes. Local soccer with hundreds of fans rallying to keep the earthquakes in the South Bay. NBC 11 Susan Sarov is live in San Jose tonight with why the earthquakes may leave. Susan. Lisa, the earthquakes have always played here at Spartan Stadium, and many people believe that's part of the problem. The owners want to either move the team, sell the team rather, or move it to a city where they can have a stadium built just for soccer. We are earthquake fans. With flags, handmade signs, and a lot of determination, South Bay soccer fans set out to save their team. This is devastating to me to know that they could be leaving. The Earthquakes owners told the team this week they're ready to move them out of San Jose, possibly to Houston. There's only one way to save it, and that's for some you know, corporate sponsorships to step up and do a stadium and buy the team. The grassroots group Silicon Valley Soccer has until September 17th to come up with some local investors. I believe in earthquake soccer. I believe there's a future for the earthquakes in the Bay Area. Alexi Lawless is the earthquakes president and general manager and also a soccer legend. He says commercial success has eluded the quakes mainly because they don't have their own stadium. The future of uh, Major League Soccer is with soccer-specific stadiums. Top of the box, here's Donovan. Donovan left it in shot. It's 2-1. Attendance has never been strong for the Quakes. In contrast, the LA Galaxy draws big crowds playing at the Home Depot Center. The stadium was built for them, but hosts all kinds of entertainment. For Eklund, the drive. Oh, what a goal by Eklund. You can see the moves and do what they do. And, yeah. Yeah, and they're like our role models, and we'd like to be like them someday, yeah. too. For young soccer players, the earthquakes are an inspiration, one they would hate to see leave. Se several city council members also to attended today's rally. They said they would like to do whatever they could to keep the team here, but admit it would be difficult to help build a new stadium since they are facing a $70 million deficit. Reporting live in San Jose, Susan Saravo, NBC 11 News. San Francisco's bus drivers say they states makes no distinction between those who carry out terrorist attacks and those who knowingly finance, manage. Times tonight, I'll meet a wireless telecom equipment. Crimes and Vietnam.